This is the video for the explanation of how to install Dynamic PDF plugin into NopCommerce local machine. I am Dyna in charge of voice. Dynamic PDF will convert an existing PDF file into a customized PDF file including purchaser's information, such as username, email address and so on. It is written in the header or the footer. After regeneration, Dynamic PDF will return download URL. and the newly generated PDF is printable but not editable. The purchaser cannot copy and paste it. If you download the plugin file, unzip the file. You will find two directories under the zip file names directory. They are for plugin directory and for source change directory. Although this software is a plugin, it is necessary to change the NopCommerce source program itself a little because you of NopCommerce built-in capability. Open your NopCommerce source directory. Open Presentation NopWeb Controllers Directory. Rename, Download Controller CS, to, Download Controller CS underscore original. Under the plugins, for source change directory, open, presentation, not web, controllers, directory. Copy, download controller CS, to not commerce directory. Under the plugins, for source change directory, open, libraries, not services, common, directory. DJ customized PDF service CS file to not commerce same directory. Copy Mike's dynamic PDF directory under for plugin directory to not commerce presentation not web plugins directory in the solution explorer of visual studio 2012 right click common directory under libraries not services directory Select Add Existing Item and select IDJ Customized PDF Service CS, which was copied. In the Solution Explorer, right click the solution name and rebuild the solution. In the Solution Explorer, open Download Controller CS file under presentation not web controllers directory confirm that the value of dynamic underscore pdf underscore local underscore debug is true
If you change the value, rebuild the solution. In the Solution Explorer, right-click NotWeb under Presentation Directory, and select Set as Startup Project Item in the Context menu. Click Start Debugging button in the top left. If NotCommerce installation page is displayed, Start to install by clicking install button. If the homepage of Knob Commerce is displayed, click login link in the top right and login as administrator. Click Administration button in the top center. If Administration page is displayed, click Configuration in the main menu and click Plugins in the submenu. If Plugins page is displayed, click Reload List of Plugins button. If you scroll down the plugin list, you will find Dynamic PDF plugin in the miscellaneous group. Click Install button of this line in the right. Again in Dynamic PDF plugin line, click Configure button. In Configure Dynamic PDF page, input guest in both API key and password key text boxes and click Save button in the bottom left. If it is saved, click Back to Plugin List link in the top. Congratulations! The installation of Dynamic PDF plugin to your local machine is completed. In more details, please visit www.digipub.biz slash 40NOP20MBC. Thank you for your listening.